only, when I come back every time, I can only remember the first. You know, I, I remember the first time that I walked up Bruin Wall and seen all those beautiful women. <laughs> but then I, actually I remember the first time that I took a class in, was it Haynes Hall? And I saw one beautiful woman that's been my wife for 25 years. I also remember her first. I remember in Powell Library, I went in for a power nap before a midterm. And I slept for two hours and I missed my first midterm, which led me to my first visit to the chancellor. <laughs> we get an opportunity to go to one of the greatest universities of all time. But it's kind of amazing because when you think about it, it's the chancellor that guides us into the next decade, the next century. And I like to bring our chancellor, Gene Block, and his wife Carol to the stage to give you a little bit of where we're going and taking us to the next level in the 21st century. Come on up. James, thank you. Thank you for all that you do. Thank you. This is, as you know folks, this is a big game. Big game. And we've, we've got to give Coach Neuheisel and his players all the support tomorrow uh, on one Saturday. It's critical that we bring the victory bell back from its imprisonment on Figueroa Street. The bell must return. So I'm, I'm proud of our teams. We, we just have a fantastic, fantastic athletic program. It's just a great place to be. And now I'd like to turn it over to my wife for a few introductions. Hello, you can hear me. So we would like to bring on the stage our wonderful coach, Valerie Condos Field, and the gymnastics, women's gymnastics team, who won the 105th NCAA championship. And then also, we'd like to invite to the stage Coach Perez and our women's softball team who won the 106th NCAA championship. Let's give them a round of applause. <laughs> Got somebody here on crutches. Uh oh. She'll be fine. She can flip. Sit down, you guys. Where's Kelly? <laughs> hey, Kelly. <laughs> First of all, I'd like to thank the Chancellor and his wife the Alumni Association, and all of you for recognizing these two championship teams in 2010. Go ahead and give it up. I'd like to take a quick moment on behalf of the softball team to share a little bit about why I believe we were so successful in 2010. I believe a big part of our success was we took great pride in wearing the four letters across our chest. This team, this team took the responsibility of carrying on the tradition of the first to 100 national championship program and university. Yeah, go ahead and give it up. And we proudly follow gymnastics with 105 and 106. So on that note, I'd like to be able to say to the football team, we wish you the best of luck. We send good karma and know that all of us bleed blue and, glow, blue and gold. And we can't wait to see you compete out there on Saturday and kick SC. There you go. On that note, my team has a little shout out for the football team. Here we go. <laughs> 